hey, welcome to my whatever day of veg, like, seventh, eighth, question mark? Eighth? No, it's seventh, isn't it? Seventh, okay. So, basically, today I'm going to talk about VidCon, and why am I looking at my slightly tilted picture thing? Really majorly tilted. Basically, today I'm going to talk about VidCon, and my problems with it, basically, like, I, I absolutely adore VidCon, but basically, this is gonna be just my problems with it. I haven't actually been to VidCon, but this is just me looking at their website and knowledge I've known from other, like, YouTubers talking about it. Dottolotto, Dodie Clark created, like, the poem cover of, like, yesterday or whatever. Um, she's talked about it quite a bit, so, like, in two videos. And talking about how, even though she's like a big, pretty big creator, um, she buys the community pass and how she gets treated pretty poorly for, for her pass. Now she couldn't hang out with a bunch of her friends, like specifically she couldn't hang, hang, hang out with Hazel Hayes because Hazel Hayes had like the highest pass or whatever, like um, invited human thing, and Dodlodl Dodie had the community one, like an average human would have, which is. Part of my problem like an average human, but YouTubers, like, kinda are average humans. Like, I'm gonna sneeze. Like, the, like, I guess this connects to the whole YouTube, uh, monarchy, not monarchy, what's the frickin' word? Like, status thing? How, like, their YouTube, like, VidCon just makes those lines really sharp. Like, it literally is, like, color-coded. Like, there's red for the community, purple for the middle part, like, uh, creators, and, uh, like, green or blue for industry. And there's a problem with this because industry, you just basically let into everything, absolutely everything. Uh, community, you let into the least amount of things, I think. I'll look at their website. Hold on a minute. Computer stop spazzing. Yeah, so basically, for community, you get into um, panels and stage, uh, like the main ones, expo hall activities, interview stage, evening concerts, festival, movie night, um, and signing photo hall. And for uh, creator, the purple one, you get into the first three, but you don't get into signing and photo hall, but you get into creator, keynote panels, workshop, lounge. So it's kind of like saying, if you're a creator, you obviously don't want to get anything signed by other YouTubers you like, because you're above that. You're not a crazy fan, girl. And it's kind of just like, I'm a creator, and I'm a fan, girl, yeah. So, why are they drawing that line? It's a smudge, not a line. And then, for industry, you get, like, into everything, including uh, industry keynote panels, like, the special industry things. But that's $600! Like, of course, if you buy it super duper early, it's less, but the normal is $600. Ain't nobody got time for that. And this is just my problem, how... It's kind of just making those lines color coordinated and organized, and it's just not okay. That makes sense. Like, cause I'm a, I was thinking like, cause the creator um badge isn't that much. It's the badge is the ticket. Isn't that much more um than the uh, community? So I was thinking, oh, I'll like eventually when I go to VidCon, cause I'm not going this year, but I'm probably gonna go the following year, um most likely. Um, I'll get the creator badge, and then, like, when my parents, like, come with me, because, uh, I'll have to be old enough to not have a parent, then. Because I'm old enough now, but I'll be 15. Whatever, I mean, my parents will still probably want to come with me, just in, for safety reasons. And, basically, they'll probably get, like, the community one, because it's, like, the easiest. Or they said they can stand in the lobby for free or something, you, you got what I mean. But they still might be interested in, like, the whole YouTube concept, so they still might want a ticket. But basically, I won't be able to, like, get signings by YouTubers I like if I want to, because I'm a creator, and I'm above that. And just, like, YouTube is, like, everyone's on the same level. Everyone can just get a webcam or camera or whatever on their phone or and just post it to YouTube. And just making these levels just is reasoned 
partially, partially, why YouTubers get, like, stuff go to their head and then they abuse people. I mean, obviously, I think, like, if you're gonna abuse people, you're gonna do it however you have power over them, whether that's just you being not a minority. But, someone's... My mom just came in and asked if I was doing homework and stuff about Girl Scouts, and I was just like, yeah, I've so been doing homework, not talking at my camera for, like, a full five minutes, just ranting about YouTube culture. So, yeah, that's basically it. VidCon is issues, but it's still pretty cool. Cause it's VidCon, and that's about it. I guess. Thanks for watching my whatever seventh day of veg vlog every day in June. Bye.